All right, round three over at the Palmetto Amateur made for a dramatic back nine finish, changing the leaderboard a few times before it settled on 18. At one point, a three were in the mix with four chasing. It ended with one standing above the rest. Only nine out of the 80 golfers in the field shot below par. In that group, you can count Jack Wheeler, Chase Nevins, and South Aikens, Miles Eubanks, who were all fighting for first place. They each birdied four more times on the back nine. Then Matt Doyle birdied 13. That moved his name to tie the top of the leaderboard. It came down to 18, where Jack Wheeler had one last birdie in him to shoot a 68. One shot ahead of the rest at four under. Doyle, who's led for most of the tournament and is Wheeler's college teammate, sits one stroke below him. It's shaping up to be an interesting Saturday. We're so used to it with qualifying in college and playing against each other every day, even when you're on the same team. But I hope Matt plays really well tomorrow. I just hope I play one shot better. I think if I stay in that mindset and get off to a good start, especially those first 13 holes, play those even par and get a few coming in, I think I have a good chance to win. Miles Eubanks is used to playing this course since it's not too far from home. He shot a two under 68, bogeying 18, which took him out of a three way tie for second. So that sticks him tied for fourth, the sole local in position to possibly win it. I would say I would know where to miss it in the right spot, but I haven't been missing it in the right spot. So I can't say that, but I have a good caddy, so he's calming me down. And I don't know, I just stay patient, just don't press anything. I can't tell them what to shoot and they can't tell me what to shoot. So it's just like we got to go and do my own thing tomorrow and stay patient and see what happens. Here's a look at the top of your leaderboard. The cut line ended up being 10 over. So that means Richard Anaclario, formerly from Aiken High School, made the cut.